It is the opening of our archives of the Archdiocese of San Antonio, which is uh, mean, which means that is the uh, uh, keeping records of individuals, situations, events, uh, important moments in people's lives uh, in, the Arch in the Archdiocese of San Antonio and in the city of San Antonio. And I say the Archdiocese because we have kept the records. Um, city, because the church was here before the city started. And we already were taking uh, records of people. Um, as a matter of fact, the book that is behind me is, has records from 1703 to 1783 of sacraments. So it's the names of, of, of uh, children, of families, uh, and special occasions in people's lives. But also, this, uh, the archives we, uh, will, will hold a lot of information about many other things, mainly about our communities. But when we think about our communities in, in the Archdiocese, we cover a very uh, extended area, 19 counties. And, and so is all that information of those communities, universities, schools, hospitals, um, uh, uh, social service that has been uh, provided over the years. But it's, it's, it's incredible to know that we as church, to see ourselves for the sake of others and service to our society, to be the keepers of memory. The memory of, of, of a culture, a, a town, a city, uh, a county, uh, from the perspective of the lives of people who practice the faith uh, or communicated to us. Not necessarily, it's only about Catholics. We can find a lot of information connected with the Catholic Church in some way from other faiths here. And so, um, well, this is the beginning. And we have a new system will be, for example, we'll not be able to bring the 2.5 the million index cards of baptisms into this place uh, physically, but we are going to uh, use the digital uh, uh, system to be able to hold all that information. And so, you know, our history is very rich, and it's the history of the people of San Antonio. What is the significance of history and, and memory for the church and for our faith? that it's very difficult to live a full understanding of our life today without going to our past. And it's very difficult to foresee how to interact with the future, building history, if we don't go to, uh, to where everything started. So we need to do that. It's, it's a must. The, the church, we needed to decide it, and I as Archbishop, to decide that we open these archives for the service of many more people. It has been always open, but we didn't have the, uh, the, uh, 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 the update necessarily to serve well. Now we have it. It's a must, and it's a moral responsibility. It's not just like, uh, well, you know, it's another little construction that has uh, beautified the place and, and uh, we'll have more order, uh, more selection. No, it is a duty to contribute with all this wonderful information to our larger society. What can you tell us about that special book as a source of identity for San Antonio mm -hmm. and for Catholics? Yeah, that book is written in Spanish from Spain and of that particular time in history. So that was written in, uh, the, uh, in the, um, at the beginning of the 1700s. And as I said, covered from 1703 to 1783. That book, some pieces already are trans translated into English and to common Spanish. Uh, one piece, for example, is the foundation of the city. You know, is it is the narration of 
the actual establishment of the city. And so it's a very important book. I cannot think of an older book in this area about San Antonio and from San Antonio. And, uh, and it's the, the fidelity of the people who, who came, you know. And of course, our history comes in 1691 with the name of the, of the river and the hope of a new city, San Antonio, because of San Antonio. And then the settlement of the Franciscans in 1709, then the, uh, the foundation of the city in 1718, and then all the rest. We have plenty of information. As a matter of fact, people, they need to know that even though we are opening this kind of a new site with new technology and, and uh, more order, it is true that every day from Monday to Friday, the, the archives have been serving the people of San Antonio. Every day people come to find uh, their certificate of marriage, the baptism. Uh, they want to know in, uh, where their family were worshiping uh, 80 years ago. And we can find that information here. Is there anything else that you'd like to add? Well, that we are grateful, and hopefully you will be able to use this facility. We are here to serve you.